cheer on our drivers. We've got Scott Young, a.k.a. The Answer. He's on board his bouncy pony, Quick Like a Bunny. Colin Kelly, a.k.a. CK. He'll be aboard Hopalong Cassidy. Then we've got Alfie Carroll, uh, also known as the Camouflage Kid. He'll be aboard Hoofin' It. Then Travis Henry, known to many as Turk. He'll be on Ripper Magoo. It's going to be a field of four. I'm going to get set to send things down to our own Greg Gangle trackside. Thanks a lot, Sugar. I've been uh, talking with these guys a little bit over the week of uh, how they're going to prepare for this year's annual Bouncy Pony Stakes and, and uh, support a Harness the Hope. And I remember when I was talking with Travis Henry, he was just going to be happy to stay aboard because usually he tends to go down in a heap. And uh, I know that Scott Young told me that he likes to have lots of afternoon naps in preparation for this. And then we have our defending champ, Elfie Carroll. And then this year's Grand River champ, Colin Kelly. So this year looks like it's going to be quite the test, Sugar. But no further ado, let's go back upstairs to you because you're going to give the call. I guess what I'm going to do, I'm going to count them down, three, two, one, and, and, then, and then say go. So are you uh, on your mark there, gentlemen? Nobody has to go back to the paddock for an equipment adjustment. All righty. So it's a three, two, one, and go. Early start there for Travis Henry. Colin Kelly's doing it well. Here comes defending champ Alfie Carroll. Colin Kelly, a little bit crooked across the line, but he appeared to win it over Alfie. Uh, Scott, the answer young, appeared to be third. Travis Henry did stay on his feet, looked to get fourth in there. Greg Gango. Yeah, we're going to have to maybe get a slow-mo from our TV department because it looked like Colin Kelly was on a bit of a line there when he crossed the wire. I'm not sure if there would be any interference there or not, but no further ado. We're going to get set for race number five, but we're going to get all the drivers to come into the winner's circle for a group presentation by our very own Jake McDonald. And Colin Kelly is also going to be presented with this year's Harness the Hope Bouncy Pony Winner, on behalf of Doreen Dustin and Christy Dustin, are going to make the presentation on behalf of KYIS. Sugar, back up to you. All right. Uh, wonderful job there, gentlemen. It looked like Colin Kelly then winning. Uh, maybe Scott the Answer Young was trying for that huge upset. Uh, maybe he did get the deuce. Alfie Carroll was right there with him. Uh, Travis Henry rounded out the four of them. So here is uh, Colin Kelly and... Uh, We've got uh, Doreen, Brandy, Christy with the spoils of victory. Colin Kelly, defending champ at Grand River and now new champ at the raceway for the Bouncy Pony Stakes. Congratulations. Great job, gentlemen. So again, left to right there in the monitors, we've got Christy and Doreen Dustin along with Alfie Carroll, Scott Young, Colin Kelly, Travis Henry, and Brandy, a daughter of Doreen Dustin there as well. So again, uh, thanks so much for the ladies organizing Harness to Hope Night. Thanks so much, gentlemen. Great show on track for the Bouncy Pony Stakes. Race 5 coming at you. It's the Dowler Karn Esso Mobile.